Just think about Kyle Larson running second. I mean, what's he had? He finished third here last year, second at Homestead. He's been second, third, second, third, I mean, all, all year long. The, that kind of consistency is going to turn into wins. It just it just has to. It will. They will hit on something. They're so, so close. Ten laps to go. These are nail biters here. This is when you sit on the pit box and hope nothing happens. And we're getting into that zone where tire and brake heat is going to be a concern. And a long green flag run. You know, guys, if Kyle Busch can close this deal, I'm going to give a big credit to his pit crew. Just look right here. They have gained or stayed, maintained position almost all day. But the real key was this stop right here. That's what got him the lead and led him the lane choice. And he's pretty much led ever since then. Yeah, Larry, ever, we've seen everybody that gets out front, it can really kind of control and dominate the restarts as well as these laps after and it's just so hard to, to to get up to that leader and make that pass we saw some of that happen maybe earlier in the race but boy when you get somebody like Kyle Busch and this 18 team they are so strong not just here but everywhere it's going to be hard to beat these guys when they're that good on pit road he's such a phenomenal restart I, I love to watch him on restarts because he will go where nobody else would dare and that's what make, it makes him a, every time there's a restart, you know he's going to pick up spots. I, I just can't help but think about this. We had the incident last week with Joey Logano and, and Kyle Busch. They come here. Who's on the pole? Joey Logano. Who's possibly going to win this race? I know it's not over yet. Kyle Busch in position to do that. And Easy all, how that motivates and, you. And you know what that means? All this forgiven. Oh, I wouldn't say all. Oh. Not quite yet. Oh, Jamie? Not, maybe next week. I talked to Kyle's crew chief this morning, and he said this year, with a brand new car in the 2018 Camry, the new rule package, aero package. We're not sure how long it'll take to get that victory because it's so different. And we have the 22, I think, blowing up. Guys are blow tired. Turn one, Joey Logano. Okay, there's a key, got some coming. Most Two likely. more coming. Two more coming. Caution out with six laps to go. <laughs> Not what it's Samantha Bush and Kyle Bush and that 18 team wanted to see. It never the 22 and Joey Logano. I heard that thing explode on the front straightaway. And we'd had a long green flag run and just getting into that danger zone where we're concerned about those right fronts from excessive brake heat and melting the bead of the tire. Oh, yeah, you can see it's going down right there. Bam. Oh, my gosh. Hard hits. Joey was 11. Look at these sudden impacts. Hold it up there if you can. Got coming. Now, what I found so interesting about that is you could see in his hands as soon as he let off the gas and got on the brakes and that tire loaded up, boom, that's when it went. Pit road is open. Here come the leaders, Matt. And Mike Rakislawski hits pit road in the top five. His team talking about making it for the short run, obviously pressured up the tires. Looks like a two tire stop here, Jamie on the two. And Adam Stevens asked Kyle, okay, what do you need? And he said, yeah, and he took a deep breath. It was right sides, Harvick. They said, I need tires, not sure how many. It's right sides, Vince. The short run hasn't been the string for Kyle Larson. Just two tires here. We'll see what he has to the finish. Kyle Larson at the end of pit road. Wow. Larson! Two tires. All the way down. But. But for Kurt Busch. They're not going to be the leaders. There's three cars that I saw stay on track. The 31, the 17, and the 78. So Ryan Newman and Ricky Stenhouse will be up front on the restart along with Martin Truex. Probably a green-white checkered here if I had to guess. You know, there's Right now there's four laps to go. Very well could only be two laps to go or one when we get this track cleaned up. Yeah, now Kurt Busch pulled out to avoid his brother, and that's why he got no tires. There's your leader pulling out. Ooh. Kind of reminds me of the finish last year, Mike. Remember, uh, I think Kevin Harvey stayed out. Carl Edwards got tires. 
Had a heck of a finish. I mean, this is what happens when you take two tires. It, it, you get on in, in your box in such a hurry, you can get out, but that's the problem. There's still cars coming down pit road that are trying to get in their box, so you have to be really careful. And Kyle Busch's reaction to the caution flag. Right on time. Deep breath, they blew a tire going into one. Oh, trust me, I know. Okay. So Joey Logano out of the race, Kyle Busch leading the race up until this round of pit stops, which leaves Ryan Newman, Ricky Stenhouse, and Martin Truex up front. Then, with two tires, Kyle Larson, Kyle Busch, Kevin Harvick, Jimmy Johnson, Brad Keselowski, Chase Elliott. Seems like in every headline you have Bush, Logano, or Logano Bush, and Logano. Bush. Yeah. They're taking all the headlines, even yeah. away from the winners these days. Now, there's Joey with Todd Gordon. He's okay. Just uh, came and walked across the pit wall. I think the break, pit. I think brake issues is really what bit him. Once he started having brake trouble, he just uh, never was the same. Somebody, it's about to possibly steal some headlines. That's the guy on your screen right now, Ryan Newman. Now I know the tires are old, but they only have to really make what two laps right. under green. It's going to be tough for those two tires to get all the way up there. But boy, it's going to be a lot of fun watching. So your front row will be Richard Childress Racing. 112 races since their last win. Roush Fenway Racing, 95 races since their last win as we go to overtime. I think the one that we're really going to have to watch here, and that's Kyle Larson. He's on the outside, second row, in fourth position. He has the two fresher tires, and, and that outside lane we've seen be really, really important on the restarts. Vince. Glad Joey's okay and out and walked away, but uh, hard hit. Brake issues ultimately? Um, no, the brakes are uh, fine on um, their at the end, just flew right front. Uh, probably just overheated the beat, I'm sure, is what it was. But um, yeah, there's nothing, not much you can do when the right front blows out, and uh, you're kind of looking at that sharp corner. So, uh, now, fortunately, we had a, a good car at the beginning of the race, and then just kind of fell off and after we got our pit road speeding penalty, and it's hard for us to get back up there. And we're getting closer, but our long run speed's just off, and we got to figure out how to get faster here on the long run. Mike. Thanks, Vince. Joey Logano out of the race. And now there you see the overtime line. Just coming out of the, the dog leg or trial on the back straightaway. So that's what we've got to get to after we get the green. So we go to overtime, sponsored by Credit One Bank. It's a two lap shootout. A green white checker. This this is as about as, as interesting as I think it, it can really get. is. This is crazy. So the first three cars, let's remember, they stayed out. They're on older tires. Fourth place, Kyle Larson, two tires. And from there on back, pretty much two tires. And Kyle, uh, Kyle uh, Bush is pinned down on the oh, inside. Watch how aggressive he's going to be. be. He's going to be three wide <laughs> when gonna, we go down into turn one. Oh, Green flag. A big mess down here in turn Newman one. Newman gets a big jump. Yeah, but that's going to open the door for Larson with those two fresh tires. Oh, no, the 72, we 17 go. got in the side of 42. They're okay. They come off the corner hard. Here comes that 18 down on the inside. McMurray slowing to the back. Watch that 18 go into turn three. Inside Stenhouse. Well, it's Way stuck. inside. It's stuck. Hard yeah, but so did the 42. Kyle Larson is going to get a big run here off of turn four. And we're coming to the white flag. One to go. Keslowski inside Harvick, working on Stenhouse. Oh, Larson got a little bit loose, but still gaining from the 31 in Newman. Newman is set sail, boys. I tell you, he's got a nice lead. They're not going to catch him. Three wide mid pack, but out front, Ryan Newman, Kyle Larson what? to be second to again. Back. So close, but I don't think it's going to be enough. Off turn four. Hello, Newman. Ryan Newman wins for Richard Childress Racing. Larson, Kyle Busch. A photo finish for Keslowski and Stenhouse give fourth to Stenhouse, fifth to Keslowski, sixth to Harvick, Suarez, Eric Jones, Jimmy Johnson, Denny Hamlin, the top ten. Nice call by Luke Lambert. I mean, that was a gamble. That's Richard Childress. Boy, isn't that the truth? Well, he, he won uh, Indy. Yeah, that's